Hello everyone and welcome to Friday. Will is in town. Hello. Welcome back. Okay, you pointed toward Dan when you said Will's in town. Yeah. Will is in town. Tell him. Tell him Hi. that Will's in town. I mean, you did. Will's in town. Okay, thank you. Appreciate it. Uh, yeah, Will's going to be with us for a few days. Going to a comedy show tonight. Um, which is, that's what you did last time you were in town, too. You can come up anytime and go to a comedy show. You can stay with us. Uh, this is, we, we came back to Danny's Barbecue, because uh, that was one of the places we went last time with Will, and he's like, let's go back there. But this also means that Tom, who has spent several years living in Texas, gets to eat North Carolina barbecue. So I'm just curious if you have any particular thoughts about it. Um, the, so the house uh, potato salad is really good. Great. Never had collard greens before, so I can't really compare that. Mm. Uh, the brisket, I will say it's not as flavorful as Texas barbecue, but it's much more tender, which more than makes up for it. Mm. Mm. Cool. What sauces did you use? I used I just used the sweet sauce, which is about what they use in, in Texas anyway. Which, yeah. again, relays back into the, like, the, flavor, the flavor not being as strong. Okay. So, um... Eating lunch now, and then uh, I think Jepson's going to join us over at Limited Run because Tom's never been. Um, and take a look over there and see what they got. Is it a bucket list? Is no, it it's a list um, of places? Is it a uh, uh, is it types of devi- uh, electronic devices you want? <laughs> it's, to- it's a list of places. <laughs> it's a list of- you got to start there. Okay. Um, it's a list of places you want to go before you die. No. Uh, is it a list of places you want to go for lunch? Is it? That's much closer. Oh, is it a place you want to go for dinner? Uh, is it a place you want to go for <laughs> for dessert? Let's, is it a place let's just say that you, you got it. Let's uh, just say, qu- uh, list of cuisines you want to try? Is it a list of um, appetizers? Dan that is an- answering as if he's on a game show. He has a limited amount of time. Um, is it? His is money's it, slowly ticking down. Um, um, is it? Is it, a, like, is it a list? Now you're only down to five thousand. <laughs> is it a list of places you want to fart in? Um, is no. it a place where uh, you 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 uh, want to clap like you just landed on an airplane? Is it a is list? It a, is it a list of places you'd like to take people to eat? Yes. Hey. Oh, is that? That's it. Dan, you lose all your money. <laughs> God, I have any of the time splitters games. Time splitters? Yeah. You should. I mean, you should because they're great. They are really good games. Two and Future Perfect are both really, really good. And one, not so much. What's like a Game Boy Color or Game Boy Advance game that I should get? Uh, Do they have? They have like some. Those are all advanced games. Uh, it's not a it's not a Game Boy Color game, but if you could find a copy of Darkwing Duck for the Game Boy, that's a <gasps> Frogger's Adventure. I played that once. I think it, okay, I, I probably have it on GameCube. What'd you get? Uh, I got um I got Time Splitters Future Perfect. I got um on your recommendation, I got uh, Return of the Oberdin. I love that game. And then uh, I also picked up because of your playthrough of it, I picked up Moon. Nice. Those are all good choices. What would you get? I got Worms Armageddon and a Street Fighter collectible card game pack. That's cool. There's so many like trading cards in there. It's a wild amount. Jepson, what'd you get? I got Repug. Ah! <laughs> I got Repugnant Bounty, which is a uh, Metroidvania that I've never heard of, okay. but uh, it looks kind of cool. And then I got Spanky's Quest. <laughs> <laughs> Spanky's uh, Quest. Spanky's Quest. Uh, I'm so glad you got Spanky the Monkey. All right, cool, great. <laughs> so we came back to the house, played some games. And most notably, we just finished playing Wingspan, which takes about an hour. This is the first time that both Tom and Will have played Wingspan. First off, what'd you think? It's a good game. It's very, it's very like, it's, it's very therapeutic. Yeah, I mean, it is, it, because it's got all like the, the bird stuff going on. There's there, like bird facts. There is like some frustrating aspects to it, like kind of having, like if you don't have enough of one resource, you have to depend on like other people to do things in order to be able to get the resources you want. Yeah, and I mean also like the birds themselves. Yeah. Structuring how you want to do things is very important. Mm. First time playing it, you just like oh, I'm just gonna have eggs now and then yeah, then. Yep. yeah. You have to kind of know what exactly what you're going for. Although, who knows what our scores are going to be? So, um, I mean, mine's face up on the table here. I had fifty five. Same. Really? Wow. Yep. Really? Yep. Oh man, I'm very worried. I had fifty six. Ooh. 67. Yeah, wow. it's like, 
I got <sighs> six birds that have that nest. I had uh, four birds that ate fish, so I got eight points and seven points. And then I had one bird with a kill power, so I got two points there. Holy cow. Oh, I didn't realize mm. that when you got the bonus. Like, I think you had to replace the a bonus card that you had mm -hmm. at the beginning. Okay. That explains a lot. So you just had bonus so, cards like, that did nothing for you, essentially. I had three bonus cards, and only one of them gave me four points. The what other you, two yeah. were tossed. What, what did the other two yeah, do? Yeah, this is why they, I got they it. were bad. Oh, okay. So they do give you points, but you but like you were not in a position to be able to I, actually do anything. I didn't. With them. Yeah, got gotcha. you to do them. And I got so. the falconer power right at the end when I played the puffin. Yeah. And it only gave me two points because I only had one. So like I wasn't able to build towards that. Uh, but I was like, out of these two, well, this one gives me two points. Okay. Yeah, it's. I really do love this game. It's it's getting easier to understand since mm -hmm. I played it. I know you've played it the most. And you're learning like, so much about birds. I know. You can learn a lot about birds. Like I said, there's a lot of thought on what each bird like how they live in the world and yeah. each one of the birds is unique, which is Yeah, cool. I think that's one of the most interesting things is that there are no repeat birds yeah. in this band, which Did is Did cool. you know that bush tits live in flocks and single adults will help raise their young? Help couples raise their young. We're learning so much about birds. About bush tits. The single mom who works too. <laughs> <laughs> Shot. Why? Who did this? It was. was I thought. I just assumed it was you. No, it's definitely a Daniel move. That's a big Daniel move. Oh, look at his face. The big, uh, it is 141, and um, we're at the Waffle House. Every, everyone's doing great. So great. Everyone's doing really great. This I waited an hour for this waffle. It's gonna be so good. Very recently on a breakfast stream, we were talking about Waffle House, and I, I made a point. I said, when you go to Waffle House, you're either going to get food you didn't order, or you're not going to get food you ordered. One of those things happens. Just it, it just just it does. And uh, this time, we didn't get. We had the All Star Special, and we didn't get waffles. And then finally, we were like, waffles. And now we got waffles. Anyway. It is very late. <laughs> it's almost How early. How are y'all doing? <laughs> Mouth's cold. We'll finish waffles and go. <laughs> How was everyone's Waffle House experience? Was it a Fine. good long? It was, was great. It bacon. Really good? Long. It was bacon? We it was bacon. We you only had long. bacon? I only had bacon. We discovered that Josh can turn water into prune juice. I did. Yeah, Jesus gave me the ability to turn water into prune juice. That was nice of him. <laughs> yeah. It was, uh, it was... I keep the, touching your butt. The, you food, <laughs> the food was good, but again, it did take us... I think we were in there for almost two hours. Yeah. Three, yeah. three days. No, it, it, no, somewhere no, between two hours actually, and three days. did we get like here? three hours. It, it definitely felt like three hours. I think, it was, I think it was an hour. Because because yeah, we, we got we got because we, we left the it was almost an hour we and left we left Abby like oh, we, yeah, left, we was, left Abby Road around twelve thirty. Uh, we got here at at one and it's almost two. Yeah, we were here for an hour. It, it felt like I could have watched like the the, the Hobbit. Or something. <laughs> <laughs> Time moves slower in the Waffle House. It's true. It is a different dimension. Anyway, I, that's it for today. Thanks oh, for watching. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I I, I played um, Raisin Toast. We know. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I got a clip of oh, that. Did you film it? I got oh, a clip of that. Okay. Okay. Never mind. I knew it was you. As soon as it came on, I was like, "That's Dan." He had the stink face. That's too. Dan. Hey. Yeah. Hey. 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 Oh, wait, wait, wait. What? Yeah. D um. You. You. Have you finished the vlog? Not, yeah. not since I've been here. Oh, go ahead and end oh. it. Especially because, like, I, will we see you tomorrow? I think we will. It'll yeah, be brief. briefly. Yeah. It'll uh, be brief. Join it. Join us. Join us again tomorrow for Stephen Amell play Stephen vlog. <laughs> <laughs> that's not. That's the ending. Buddy.
buddy. All right. That's the new motto for 2024. <laughs>